Hello viewers, I'm back today with more Assassin's Creed 2, and we're gonna head do this mission, but first, let me run around the room, make sure OBS doesn't give me the high encoding garbage. I changed this setting, so it shouldn't. That's how I usually fix it. I, I don't seem to be getting it, I might be good. Yeah, I think I'm good. Alright, let's go talk to her. Don't worry. We're only staying here for a little while. I don't like it here. I want to go home. I know. Why don't you like it? It's all fancy and nice. I like it. Well, that was a fast mission. Hola, how you doing? Salute, uncle. I did as you asked. And quickly, too. Pan fatto. Now, let's teach you how to fight. No. As I said, we are leaving. Ezio, you barely held your own against Vieri. You won't survive a week on the road. If you want to leave, so be it. But at least do so armed with the skills and knowledge necessary to defend yourself. If not for me. For your mother and sister. Fine. Optimo. You can swing a sword to be sure, but offense alone will not carry a battle. You must survive long enough to strike. I will teach you how to dodge. You said my father was more than just a banker. No use dancing around it, I suppose. Your father was an assassin, Ezio. I told you before, my father was a paper pusher. No, he was born and bred to kill. I find this difficult to believe. You're wearing his clothes. What do you carry? Do you think it's merely a catalog of deaths? It holds the names of those responsible for your father's murder. Can we get on with this? Or are we just gonna stand here? Like idiots. Hello? Hello? Can we start? I'd love to. Alright. Mission's bugged, not working. How do I abort? Abort, abort, abort. Go talk to him again. Hopefully this time it doesn't bug. Salute, uncle. I did as you asked. And quickly, too. Pan fat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, I heard all this. Let's Hurry teach up. you how to fight. Yeah, sure. No. Go ahead. As I said, we are leaving. Ezio, you barely held your own against Vieri. You won't survive a week on the road. If you want to leave, so be it. But at least do so armed with the skills and knowledge necessary to defend yourself. If not for me, for your mother. Oh, sister. shut up, uncle. Fine. Optimal. Better not bug this time. You can swing a sword to be sure, but offense alone will not carry a battle. You must survive long enough to strike. I will teach you how to dodge. You said my father was more than just a banker. No use dancing around it, I suppose. Your father was an assassin. I told you before, my father was a paper pusher. No, he was born and bred to kill. I find this difficult to believe. What of the list you carry? Do you think it's merely a catalog of deaths? 
It holds the names of those responsible for your father's murder. My god. These controls are the worst thing I've seen in any video game I've ever played in my entire life. Nobody uses the mouse as a sole controller to the keyboard's for. Die! Just die, I don't care about blocking. I do perfectly fine this way. Especially since that, uh, foot isn't a key. I'm sorry, but there's no foot on my mouse pad. Hate to break it to you. I think that's it. No, it's not. Doesn't work either. Oh my goodness. Go away. Sbrigati! Devo incontrare una amica. Okay, there we go. About time! Ben, I've taught you how to avoid your enemies' attacks. Now you'll learn how to turn them to your advantage. Shut up and do it. I don't care. All this talk of assassins and templars. It reeks of fantasy. Like something from an old parchment covered in asking writing. How did you know? You have your father's blade. I gave you to have the codex page he's holding his left. Codex. See, it guides the inner workings of the order. Its origin, purpose, and techniques. Our creed, if you will. Your father believed the codex contained a powerful secret. Something that would change the world. Perhaps it's why they can break. I intention to start an Olympia. Come on, there is only one of me. Do I want of him too, Ezio? You're making fine progress, Ezio. Today I'm going to teach you how to position yourself in battle. Where you stand and how you move can make all the difference. Don't think I haven't seen you picking apart my library. I trust you believe me now? Yes. My father was an assassin. But why the need for such secrecy? Are you familiar with the Templars? One of several knightly orders formed during the Crusades. History teaches they were disbanded nearly 200 years ago in France. Only they weren't. Merely pushed underground where they continued the nefarious work. Oh god, I'm playing you. Once you learn how to do this, the game becomes the easiest thing in the world. Well done, Nepote. You've really come into your own. Thank you, Uncle, for all you have given me. Your family. Such is my duty and my desire. I'm glad you had me stay. Good. You've reconsidered leaving. We sail for Spain in three days. But Nepote. I have given you these skills that you might be better prepared to strike against our enemies. And if they find me, I will. You want to leave Ezio? To throw away everything your father fought and died for? To deny your heritage? Fine. Come voi. Arrivederci e buona fortuna. Uncle, wait. Why is he so upset? How can he not be? Vieri's been harassing us ever since you first arrived. To be expected, I suppose. Given his heritage. everyone. They ride for San Gimignano to slay that snake, Vieri. I wish to join them. You'll find what you need at the stable. Let's go to the stables. If my guy would stop climbing the wall. Uh. 
These aren't even stables. That's where it told me to go. Oh, whatever. Why can I loot that? Oh, once again, whatever. God dang it. Stop climbing the wall, Ezio, you idiot. Alright, there's no stable here, dude. Don't know what you were trying to tell me to go, but... Obviously not here. These are the best stables I've ever seen. The best. Guys, have you ever seen stables these good? I mean, seriously, look at all the horses. You, you, I mean, there's so many of them. I don't know which one to choose. Yep. Just gonna start attacking the wall. Maybe that'll make a stable pop up or something. Trap door? Nope. Didn't think so. Okay, what if I go on the roof then? Are there stables on the roof? Do the horses fly? Well, what a surprise. There are no stables on the roof either. Alright, are you kidding me? I don't understand. Guys, help me. This game's stupid. On the second floor, then. Why you said you went for the stables? I was supposed to go to stables, not see you guys. Ezio, look at her. I still can't get her to talk. She spends all day and night in front of those feathers Petruccio used to collect. She can't let them go. I don't know what to do. Don't worry. She'll come back to us. I know it. Wow. Awesome. Awesome collection. Am I actually heading to the stables now? What a shock.
Can I take the carriage? Let it do all the riding for me. Yes, except. Oh, whoa. Hey, let's go. Move. I said move. Get out of the stupid. Ezio, what are you doing here? Taking responsibility. Vieri troubles you because of me. <laughs> Vieri troubles us because he's a Templar, and we are assassins. Either way, I wish to help. Va bene, then listen close. First, we must find a way inside the city, though it seems Vieri expects us. He has sealed the gates and sent his men to guard them. Fortunately for us, the city is larger than his host. The southern gate suffers for it, so this is where we'll strike, Pronti. Yep, I'm ready. Let's go. Let's go, Mario. That's just slow. If I go back here, I won't be able to catch up to him. The horse is just following us. Okay. All right, Ezio. Here's how it is going to work. My men and I will distract the guards. Once we have engaged them, get yourself over the wall and find a way to open the gate. Take these throwing knives. Use them to dispatch the archers. I'm ready when you are. Then let us begin. Al attacko! Come on in. You guys need help. Help you kill this people too. I want you to distract those guards and keep them from raising the alarm. Hopefully, it will buy me enough time to find and silence Vieri. Va bene. Wait, Nipote. Take a few of my men with you, just to be safe. Come join me once they're dealt with. What's Vieri up to now? 
No one knows. But something has an edge. How else to spell it? I'll signal again when you should follow. Sorry about that. Die. Oops, I hate my team. Let's go. Your uncle's under attack and needs help. Go to him. Many bad guys. I want you to want to hit. Who's on that stage? See the jump. Alright, we handled them. Now, let's go find that guy, shall we? Tori Del Savucci. Rebecca 84 won the string of Limshot matches on this landmark. You should go find it. Yeah, but the last one there was none. In a city famous for its towers, the Savucci family, in a display of 13th century might, erected not one, but two. And not only did they erect two, they built them to be taller than the ruler of San Gimaginianos, the Podesta's tower. Despite a law made in 1255 that prohibited such an act of blatant brick and mortar style aggression. Outraged, the Podesta forced the towers to be cut down until they were smaller than his. What's that? Can't go that way, boss. <coughs> Get up. <laughs> eh. I really don't care about those squint things. This area is strictly off limits to you. And many other items too to harmonize. Hmm, where is he up here? <coughs> Checkpoint reached. It's settled. 
I'm gonna end this episode here, guys. Cliffhanger. Thanks for watching.